guys, how are you? It's Jean Lutz, and I am finally showing you guys my daily routine makeup video. This foundation I've been using forever, it's Giorgio Armani Luminous Silk. So I'm gonna use uh, shade 6.25. But I'm gonna apply this all over my face. People always ask me like how I am so good at makeup, and my mom was a makeup artist when I was little and I would go with her. She used to work at Nordstrom's and she worked for a um, makeup line called Tony and Tina, which has been discontinued, but it was <laughs> a dream. It was like sparkle, sparkly eyeliner, shimmery stuff. Like it was like one of the first makeup brands I think that really jumped out of the box with fun stuff to put on your face, honestly. Um, I feel like Mac did it like right after that one funny story So when I was in third grade <laughs> This is such a funny story um, When I was in third grade uh, My you know for the holidays You know they felt like little parties in the classrooms and they would have they would sign random moms uh, to be room moms and the room moms would come and they would bring like fun games for, oh, I'm sorry. Also, I, I wet this beauty blender and I'm applying it. Okay, so then, so, uh, so my mom was room mom. You're supposed to bring activities for kids to do in the classroom. And so a lot of parents would bring like little cotton balls and make like little snowmen and whatever. My mom would bring her makeup and she would just do all the girls makeup in the classroom. And the principal came in and was like freaking out. And she's like, these girls are in third grade. Their parents are gonna freak out if they go to school with makeup on. My mom's like, oh no, don't worry. I put makeup on my daughter all the time. She loves makeup. These girls love it. And it was a, a big thing and it was so funny. And I loved it, but people wonder why I like makeup so much. <laughs> Um, okay, so I'm gonna take Tarte Shape Tape Concealer and I use the shade light medium sand. I feel like this is always the best color I'm gonna do a little concealer I'm not gonna go too nuts with it Because I feel like a lot of foundation and a lot of concealer ages me a ton And we can always clean up and add more later but Right now I'm just gonna Go a little around the eye. I am now going to take Patrick Ta's Four Face Bronzer, and I'm going to take the brush that comes with it, which is the Patrick Ta brush. And I'm gonna take the top, it's kind of like a cream bronzer, I love this stuff. And I'm gonna start contouring so I mainly go a little darker towards my ear and I fade forward. Um, cool, so now that I have bronzer, I'm gonna go in with the OG MAC Gold Deposit. I'm in love with this stuff. I actually had this stuff for years and I was like, oh, I don't really like shimmer on my face. And Amrezy, um did a tutorial, love her, and she talked about that this was like her, like, she really swore by this stuff. I'm like, oh yeah, I have that stuff. And one time I put it on and I was getting so many compliments and every time I wore it, people were like, oh, your skin looks really good. So I am now a huge fan and I'm running out. So I'm gonna take a SK brush. I get my brushes from Malta. And I'm gonna get some product on there. And I'm gonna go right in between the top of my cheekbone and the bottom of it. I love this stuff, it's ColourPop. But these are, it's like a duo, a duo highlighter and a blush. So I'm gonna take the same brush that I used the gold deposit on and I'm gonna put 
put it on the cheekbones. So my favorite part now is highlighter. You cannot have too much highlighter on. I don't care what anyone says. People always tell me how much my highlighter is popping. So I'm gonna take a brush like this. It's like a fluffy shedding brush like mine. And I'm gonna go in with this gold highlighter from ColourPop. And I'm gonna go, ooh, ooh, oh, yes. And I'm gonna go outside and a little up. So I'm gonna take a little brush like this and I'm gonna brush my eyebrows upward. So I'm gonna go, um, I'm gonna go in with this. This is my favorite, one of my like all time, like my number one product that I love to use. And it's Stella's Stay All Day Waterproof Brow Color in Dark. I love this stuff. And I'm gonna, okay, this is kind of hard. So I'm gonna start from here and I'm gonna brush upwards. So I actually like using the, the colors that I've used on my face, on my eyes, for natural, just contouring of the eyes. So I'm going to go in with my bronzer that I use. I really like the pigment of this. And I'm going to go on the bridge, uh, the eye, uh, the eye bone. I'm gonna take another brush like this and I'm gonna go in with this highlighter because I'm in a shimmery type of mood right now. I don't always do this. And I'm gonna kind of glide it around. I'm going to take, I'm gonna, st I'm gonna do a wing just on the outside of my eye starting where my eye color starts, if that makes sense. I'm gonna, try, I'm gonna try to do this. <laughs> and I'm gonna go on the inside of my eye right here, just from the start of my eye color and then to the corner of my eye. Now I'm gonna take Marc Jacobs uh, this is their matte gel crayon eyeliner. I love this stuff. This stuff like really This stuff stays And I'll just shove this baby in my eye and close my eye and move it around Okay, so now I'm gonna do some mascara and I use L'Oreal's Voluminous Original I've been using this stuff since high school. The way I do my mascara is I actually focus on my outer lashes more than all of them because my eyes are a little round, I think. So, or maybe a lot of round. But I want it to be like a little lift here and a lot of lift here to really give that natural cat eye. I'm going to take my brow powder and I'm going to just kind of go, I'm focusing more on the outside of my eye, just like a natural, like I'm not putting a lot of product at all. I'm literally like dabbing it and then putting it on. I just want a little contour without there being like such an obvious shadow. So I'm going to go in with these medium strips and I'm going to put some some duo glue in black because it just kind of blends in with the eyeliner that I already have. And I'm gonna put them right where my liner starts that we started, like where the color starts. I'm 
And I'm gonna go with mascara and kind of go where I didn't put eyelashes to kind of blend it a little more. Oh, these are looking a little more fierce. Oh, really? Two medium ones would have been great too. Okay. Ooh, look like eyelash extensions with a knot. I wish I could wear eyelash extensions. My eyes are so sensitive. I get pink eye every time I've tried it. So, now I'm afraid. All right, so my favorite part, we're gonna do lips. This is Kat Von D's Everlasting Lip Liner in Lolita. This, the eyebrow pen, is probably my two like must-haves for makeup products. So I'm gonna start with at the V. I'll go up first and I'm gonna Okay, so I'm gonna put a little gloss. So see, it's, I just kind of targeted the outside of my lips. I kind of, it's kind of like a lip contour. I'm gonna take So Juicy Pumping Gloss by ColourPop. And this is in shade She's Here. I'm gonna kind of dab it. I don't like, I don't usually put a ton of lip gloss on it. I love 90s makeup. And just 90s anything. I've always been that way. And I feel like I like more matte. So I'm a little shiny. I usually will leave myself shiny and then I'll put on powder throughout the night or wherever I'm, I'm at. Because when I, when I bake and then I go somewhere and then I need to touch it up or put more powder on, it starts kind of like layering a ton. So as much as I love baking, I don't love baking. So I take, this exploded, but this stuff, this is my third favorite product that I have to have. It's Kat Von D's Lock It Blotting Powder and Light. And I'm gonna take a fluffy brush like this. And this is Morphe's brush in M510. And I'm gonna get some product on there. I'm just gonna lightly get rid of the shine, kind of set in everything. This is like my natural glam. That's what this is. This is my natural glam makeup look. Do I like it? I might go a little more with my eyebrows. I always go back with my eyebrows when I'm done with my look. But now that I have lashes and everything, I feel like my face can handle more eyebrows. Okay, I think I'm not, I'm not bring this out. <laughs> My boyfriend always says, he's like, cause he's really on me on time cause we can get lost in the bathroom. I can be here for hours. He's like, you'll get ready until I tell you that you have to leave. <laughs> like you'll just keep going. I'm like, yeah. <laughs> okay, so. This is my, let me get this out of the way so you can see more. Here is my natural glam makeup. I hope you guys like it. I hope you guys have learned something. Let me know what you guys think. It was really fun doing this. I'm definitely gonna be doing a lot more of these. So take care.